hemp companies be aware of or be thinking of when adding dietary supplements into their hemp products? Yeah, Asa, I, I love this question. And, and it's definitely one that, that every company considering adding hemp or CBD to their products um, should, should really think carefully mm -hmm. about. So, you know, dietary supplements are a category of food. Um, and therefore, unless a law or a regulation contains an exception for dietary supplements, you need to follow basically the same laws and regulations that apply to food products. For example, understanding your food safety obligations under FISMA, um, following nutrient content claims regulations, and, and so much more. Um, so, you know, so claims like phytocannabinoid rich, which I, I, I see quite often, cannot be made for a dietary supplement. Um, and it can also have class action ramifications. Um, and, and then there are important requirements that apply only to dietary supplements, like setting up a system to monitor adverse events and reporting serious adverse uh, event reports to, to FDA. So it's not as simple as finding someone to produce and label your products. There are a number of, of dense and technical areas of compliance, um, especially those affecting safety that need to be understood. Um, you know, one other issue uh, is combining CBD with, with other ingredients. Um, for example, melatonin. Um, you know, you have, have two ingredients that uh, with CBD you know, could potentially cause somnolence at certain levels. And we know melatonin um, also causes drowsiness. Um, and, and, or what if you're combining CBD with a, an ingredient like caffeine or, or another ingredient that has a stimulating effect? You know, what, what, is the, what does the safety of that product look like? And also you have to consider substantiation um, and are the claims that you're trying to make for CBD so somehow going to be affected by the presence of this other ingredient? Is there a synergistic effect? Is there an antagonistic effect? Um, you know, so, so understanding the full range of, of FDA and FTC compliance issues that come up, just moving beyond the farm bill and, 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 and sourcing issues, um, there are, are quite a few considerations to um, understand and, and work through.